What's up, everybody? It's Man Man from Philly. I'm here. Uh, actually, I had to take my last video down due, some, due to some technical difficulties. The Roland rep saw that I had a motif module in there. It wasn't my fault. It was because of John. Let me get that publicly out there. John wanted me to use a specific sound out of it. That's why they were in there. Now that that's done. Now to my new rig. Um, everything's rolling, of course. My number one sponsor and who I endorse. Um, Man, let's start with my rig. Over here is the center of my battleship. That's what I'm gonna call it, my battleship. This is um, the Phantom X8, which will actually soon be replaced with the G8 come Tuesday. Um, I'm running uh, most of my Rhodes, piano, and all my main sounds right here. Um, then I have X7 for a lot of you know, my other synths and everything like that. Basically, that's what all the rest of this stuff is for. Synths and trigger and samples and just a bunch of everything. I'm just, I'm the only keyboard player now, so it's a lot on me. And uh, right here, I'm running main stage, which is giving me a lot of um, other sounds and layers. That's linked into my, um, my X8. So, you know, nothing, I'm not really running anything major out here, just a lot of pads and extra synths to layer with my roads and everything here. Anybody that has a Phantom X series, you gotta get the SRX 12 cards, the 60s and 70s EP card. Phenomenal. Um, over here I have, can't, can't play without a real B3. So I had to get a real B3 in my setup. Um, right here I have the v, the v Synth GT, which just came out not too long ago, but it's basically a hardcore synth. Um, you can have basically two sounds up at once with two different volumes. Right now I have like a synth but that's basically what's going on over here. Um, then the B3, Leslie, all that good stuff. Then over here, um, I'm running um, 1824 is really my backup. But as far as show that, so I'm running um, Logic Pro. I'm running five, five outs from there. Two for you know drums and percussions and samples and, and uh, two lines for you know extra keyboard parts and additional samples and things off the record. Um, I pre-recorded a lot of well not a lot but I pre-recorded some various parts that I can't physically play so dump those in there. Actually using a lot of sounds out of the Phantoms, the V synth, a um, couple Logic sounds and. Um, Basically, I'm running the, the master click for the show, which goes over to the drummer. Um, and I practically you know, have everything color coded based upon the song. So I can have, uh, I basically have like four songs loaded at a time. So right now I have the intro, the lifted, green light, say we're all loaded up. And that's basically what's going on with my rig as of now until I expand it. It's gonna, believe it or not, get bigger than this. Um, as far as all of my keyboards, I'm submixing in the Allen & Heat 16 channel board, um, which gives me the ability to send out the right mixture of layers and everything because some sound men just don't do the job. And they just don't know what's coming from where or even if it's an emergency situation where my main keyboard, if the power trips or anything happens, I still have a backup to go anywhere. So right now I'm equipped to play any sound at any time during the show. And that's really what's going on. It's a lot different from uh, when I was out with Kanye because I was playing a lot less, just talk box, full quarter, some piano stuff here and there, which was, was pretty fun. You know, I was using a lot of Roland's other gear, you know, V-Synth, uh, XT, Rack, uh, the VP550, I was using Phantom G6, um, Phantom X7, you know, pretty much that was my rig for Kanye. So now I'm back with John Legend. It's, it's a lot more musical far as for me, because I'm actually the, the nucleus far as musically, arrangements and different things like that. Programming the show and definitely turned into a good gig. We got Rashid on drums now. He's sounding great. We got some electronics going on in his rig. So it's turning out to be a good gig.